well, my philosophy is that a chef, as a chef are pretty simple, and it is, you know, it, it's always been all about understanding your guests, and understanding your guests really means that you, I want to be as creative as I can possibly be. I, that's what I, that's what make keeps this interesting to me. The concepts that I've really enjoyed is is doing the concepts for the first time, and and I think that um, that's what has motivated me so much is really saying, okay, what do guests want today that maybe they didn't want 10 years ago? Maybe they didn't want five years ago. What are they going to want tomorrow? When a guest walks in, what are they going to see? What are they going to feel? How is it going to okay. be different? Well, see and feel are two things that really go hand in hand when you start talking about design. Because I've always had a very, very simple approach to design, and it's been timeless. Every time that I start with a designer, the first thing I, I want to talk about is how are we going to make this room timeless? I believe in timeless because I think what timeless gives you is it gives you very clean rooms. It gives you clean lines. You'll enter into the front part of the room where it will be wood and it will be a little bit more loungy feeling um, and it'll be exposed to a view outside, um, outside of the doors. And then the bar is on the opposite side of the room. And so the whole area is surrounded by energy and that's the idea. I don't want a whisper joint. I don't want a place that people feel like they have to whisper. Maybe their chair is very comfortable because it's a nice, big, comfortable chair, but that's not what I mean by comfort. I mean that I want people to feel comfortable in my restaurant. I want them to come in and the energy from the bar spills into the restaurant and they work hand in hand to where you start to feel in the chair, you start to feel that, wow, this is great. I'm part of some energy. I'm part of some action. I'm in city center. I'm in Aria. I've got an amazing location. I have, I've worked with an amazing designer, worked with a great team. You know, it's, it's all built around quality, just like Bellagio was. I think that that's something that when you start with that foundation, you want to be part of that. When you're a chef, you want to be part of that because you look at, you know, you look at your neighbors and it's not bad to be neighbors with um, the Maccionis and Julian Serrano and, uh, um, and John George and Massa, I mean, the list goes on and on, but you look at the people that you get to associate yourself with and, and get to have your name next to, and you know that it's all going to be about quality.